So Lissetti visited Rika's hoping that she could knock some sense into Rika's head. But unfortunately, I don't think it really went in because now Rika does not see anything wrong that he did. And Lissetti is so worried with the fact that he is not concentrating when it comes to business wise. He missed so many meetings. Also, the app, WhatsApp, he's not even updating, which means he's not informed and in touch with the current situation in the business. However, the problem was that he even packed in a way that is really not too kind because now he took two people's packing where are the others going to pack and he does not even know that the tenants they're coming back today like he's so out of touch out of mind and Lissetti is worried about that and she was just expressing how upset she was until Chris decided to step in when he did guess what he sees nothing wrong he says that Rikas was just drinking a bottle of two. Imagine somebody who is mixing his medication with alcohol. And for the record, he had a blackout again. And of which uh, Chris does not see anything wrong or about him drinking alcohol and taking pills at the same time. Until the time when he says that he cannot exactly remember what happened yesterday. So that should have been a wake up call for Chris. But hey, he's his father nothing is wrong he was just having some bit of fun anyway let us move right along um so after him saying that he had a blackout he cannot remember anything chris now had to explain exactly what happened yesterday and of which he did not explain the entire thing that he actually got almost got into a fight with marco no he did not say that part he just said that we had a drink with the bassons and then from there we came home and you parked in two parking that's all <sighs> okay let us move right along so Nozzy finds this guy who buys him buys her everything that she wants and then immediately when that guy goes on a call then she decided to sneak out and run away now she's saying that the guy um the reason why i left is because i saw my ex-boyfriend sitting next to you so i decided to leave so that does not explain anything because she left with a lot of money because this guy is complaining to say you coming to my house does not become very cheap you know so you need to come because he actually offered to give her the key and she refused said you know what actually tonight you're going to come back to my house hmm. let us move right along so guess what that guy is katie's father how interesting is that? And to think that Katie and Nozzy, they're almost the same age. Huh, it's quite worrying because Nozzy lied and said she was going for a shoot at night, but it was not true. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching my video. I'll see you on my next upload.